And the two of you actually met through Brentford, is that right? That's right, yeah. Uh, 25, 26 years ago, uh, we had a friend in common, and uh, who's a Brentford sport as well. And then, um, haven't looked back. Yeah, we've been sitting season tickets now for, what, 20 years in the same. So, um, yeah, we've been through many ups and downs. Yeah. <laughs> more, more downs, but more, yeah. more ups more recently. What are you most excited about going into the new stadium? Oh, I mean, it's just having taken so long to actually get here. And, I mean, every time I drive past it, I can't help but look at it. And it's just amazing, isn't it, just yeah. to look at it, the size of it. Um, and also, be nice not to have to leave your seat five minutes before <laughs> half-time to get a beer. And also not to get wet when you queue to get a beer as well. That, that, but uh, it's no. me that does that, though. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> and is there a game in particular that you're looking forward to in the new ground? Um, well, hopefully Barcelona will be the uh, test match. That would be nice. Um, but, I mean, let's, uh, let's, let's hope we're in the Premier League. And, uh, you know, who knows? Eh, who knows? Man United at home? Any, yeah, any game in the Premier League, actually, you know. And it all feels so close these days. That's the difference with now being a Brentford supporter. And that's it. I mean, the stadium set us up for that Premier League football, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's a dream, isn't it, really? You know, these are a thing of dreams.